our internal organs the outer parts of our body like eyes ears nose hands legs etc are called external organs there are many other delicate organs also which help our body to function properly these organs like brain heart lungs etc are known as the internal organs internal organs the brain the brain is a very important organ of the body it is very delicate and located inside the skull and is the center of the human nervous system it controls all the activities movements memories and decisions of the body brain receives and sends messages to all parts of the body through nerves all other organs follow its instructions thus it is called the control center of the body the heart the heart is one of the most important organs in the human body it is located inside the chest slightly to the left and is well protected by a rib cage it is like a closed fist divided into two halves it is continuously pumping blood in our body through blood vessels the blood carries food and oxygen to all parts of the body the lungs our body has two lungs they are like soft moist sponges which are extremely delicate they help in the process of breathing the air we breathe in fills the lungs the oxygen from the air mixes with the blood and carbon dioxide is given out the lungs send the absorbed oxygen to different parts of the body through blood the liver the liver is the largest internal organ of our body located in the upper right side of the abdomen this organ mainly helps in the digestion of food it protects our body from poisonous chemicals formed inside the body it stores the energy produced from the food that we eat in the form of a sugar called glycogen another important function of the liver is to purify the blood it helps to keep our body temperature constant it is also called the factory of our body the kidneys Our body has two bean-shaped organs called kidneys. They are located in the lower abdomen. The kidneys filter the waste products from the blood. The waste is excreted out of the body as urine. The stomach. The stomach is located in the upper abdomen of the body. The food we eat goes to the stomach through the food pipe. The food is broken into smaller pieces in stomach and mixed with stomach juices to form a liquid called hydrochloric acid. This acid is extremely important for the proper digestion of the food. Thus, the stomach helps in the digestion of the food. The small intestine. The small intestine is like a coiled tube of about Seven meters. The food in the stomach moves to the small intestine. Here, the food is further digested and changed into soluble form. It is then absorbed by the blood. The digested food gives us energy to work and play. The undigested food reaches the large intestine. The large intestine. It is about 1.5 meters long. The undigested food from the small intestine goes to the large intestine. Here, the water in the undigested food is absorbed and the waste is passed out of the body. These internal organs are extremely important. Proper care should be taken so that they function properly. Know this. The human brain is over 3 times as big as the brain of other mammals. 
that are of similar body size.